this is going to be a cracker. Both of these boys are top of the tier, 63 kilo fighters. Obviously, Jordan, as I was saying earlier, his, his movement through the ranks, I guess, honestly, I, th I feel like it was second to none. He, from as a 57 kilo fighter, he was doing pretty good, and then bang, he he, he went straight to the top as a, as a 63 kilo fighter. Oh man, Jordan, you know his transformation is just amazing. He went from, as you said, a 57 kilo cheeseburger eating bastard. To act, absolutely just becoming a horse now, like just the amount of training that he puts in, you know, morning before and work and the other. He had, the, he had well. the win over Apposit, didn't he? Yeah. yeah. Apposit, KT Gym, Channel Seven champion, as we talked about earlier tonight. The, to beat a to beat a tie like that. Yeah. And this is Big the rematch support. as well. So, well, that's it. Young young Jordan got beaten by. You know, Roy's always been a bull. He's, there's no two ways about it. He's always gone about his business like a bull. And Jordan was a bit young, and he got he got run over. Yeah. But this is this is a time for him to different fighter to, now to make a move. Exactly. Roy Roy is the the staple of the 63 kilo division. He is. He he basically he, he's the gatekeeper. And uh. Everyone, know, everyone knows Roy Wills in Australia. He's oh, that's absolute, it. He's been tearing up the division for God knows how long now. And he just keeps that same style as well. I've never seen him get rocked. Have you ever seen him get rocked? He never gets hurt. I'm fortunate to have fought him twice. And exactly. I was just going to say you that. You can't. Hey? It's, you know what you're in for. You, you're not going to break him. you you, you got to... You're one of the very little people who have, you know, fortunate enough to beat him. Oh yeah, definitely. Fortunate is a, a good word. Um, <laughs> uh, last time I fought him, he, I just come off the back of an injury and and all the rest, and I just come off the back of a broken arm, and he kicked my arm so bad I thought it was broken again. <laughs> <laughs> I was lucky to get out of that fight with a with a, a narrow points win. Is Roy? It's always struck me. Is Roy one of those people where, like, until you stand in the ring with him, you don't know his power. Uh, He's a bull. I'm a big Roy Wills fan. I'm a big Jordan fan. This is going to be a great fight. Exactly. Everyone's been looking forward to this fight. There's a lot of talk about it. And the best bit is, my old man's in the centre ring and he's just going to be loving every minute of this. to be. Good old Bill Seth. That's it. Look, look how happy he is. He knows he's going to be the best seat in the house. Yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is for the WKN World Title Eliminator. Very prestigious belt to have. The winner of this will fight the challenger for the WKM World Title. Oh. Here we go, round one. It's going to be an exciting fight. Oh, Jordan with the head kick straight off the bat. Oh, he already landed a hard leg kick. Both boys still staying Both. composed. Jordan looks in fantastic, Nick. Look at the state of him. He's he's shredded. He's ready to go. Both of them have mentioned they've had really clean camps. No one's like complaining about anything. They're both fit and strong. No niggling injuries or anything. Both really I, at the peak of their career. I don't think Roy Wills ever gets injured, to be fair. <laughs> yeah, good point. The thing about Roy Wills, and I talk about Thai boxing a lot, and I you know, teach Thai boxing. Roy Wills personifies doing the basics. He does the basics so well, and that's 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 the hardest thing to combat. That's why. So that's why I was asking you, like, is he just one of those people until you get in the ring with him? Because he's just mastered the basics so well. It's like you don't realize yeah, he's not his doing strength. anything flashy. He's going to kick you. You know he's going to kick you, but it's going to kick you so hard that it's a problem. Yeah. It's a problem you have to try to mitigate as the fight goes on. And yeah, that's what Roy does. He does the basics very well. And he's got a good chin. He doesn't sh wave his chin in the air. He doesn't give it to you. But he, yeah, he puts his chin down. He's willing to step in the fire and he's willing to hit you hard. Very well balanced. And 
and that's the same with Jordan as well. He's never been rocked. See that there? Honestly, right then, Jordan held back. Yeah. He showed him a little respect. Jordan needs to let that respect go. The good thing is too, He's like, good enough. He's good enough to hurt him. Yeah. Jordan's a very smart fighter. Oh, he is. He's the good thing is that, like, with the basics as well. He's, he's, showing, he's showing a wee bit of respect right now. He's just one of those guys that, you know, he, he just trains by the book, like, more than anyone else. Like, same with Roy. He just masters the basics, and that's all he needs to do. He doesn't need to do a show pony. He doesn't need explosive power. Yeah. He's just going to break you down, and that's what he wants a, to do. A beautiful checking right there. He's showing... Jordan is showing a lot of composure and a lot of skills beyond his years right now. And he, he's, he's about half a second away from capitalizing. I think he can, I think he can bite down just a little bit more on his shots and, and show a bit. Because he, he's doing all the right things right now. And so is Roy. Roy, as a, a smart fighter, doubles his kick up. Jordan wants to lock up in the clinch where he's very strong at. Very close round. Both of them walking back to their corners confident in what they're doing. And both of them are, both of them are heading in the right direction. Like, that's, that's the game. Like, hey, Roy, do work. <laughs> so, Roy's going to go out there and he's going to... Second round, round two. That's the thing. Can Jordan put good enough pace on Roy to, to break him? I don't think... No one's ever broken Roy. No. no one's ever broken him, so what can Jordan do to to slow him down? Jordan looks very focused though. Look at him, he just looks very focused. Nice knee lock by Roy. Good defense. Oh, see that I I love the double up on that kick by Roy. It's a it seems so simple, but it's such a veteran move. Everyone checks the first kick. They don't check the second one. You were quite the low the low kick attacking fighter yourself. Like I'm sure you've seen that. Yeah. Such an under, underrated move. That most fighters will check the first. They put their leg down the se oh, the second. That's the one that lands. Yeah. Even with a, a low middle kick, you chop the low first, bang, double up on the middle. Yeah, and that definitely comes with experience because if you look at their records, Roy's had 53 fights and Jordan's had 28. Yeah, Jordan's legs starting to get a bit busted up. Look at that, it's, it's pink. He's doing well though, he's not showing anything, but he is welted. You can see that Roy has been throwing his shots with power. And I was very surprised, having fought Roy twice, obviously, that most people, when they in the pocket, they throw that, that slapping knee. It doesn't really hurt that much. Roy is sneaky. He, he gets you with that point of the knee, and you're like, oh, oh, I can't just relax. I can't just let him have those knees. He's probably the only fighter that's really actually got, caught me out napping in the clinch. Yeah, with right. A, with a sneaky slapping knee like that. One of his little tricks of the trade. Yeah, and he's he's got he's got power. He, he's got power. You don't think he does. He got he's got a little bit of power behind his punch. If you if you get caught napping, he'll get you. Really hard to see who's coming on top of this round. They're both just pretty even in my eyes. Jordan's pressing on late. He's doing well. What an awesome matchup, though. This fight's just been, you know, supposed to happen for a long time now. And there's no other show will be on right now than other than domination. It's like a slight cut on Roy. Trying to work out is on oh, the eye. Oh, he's cut. Roy's cut on the eye. He's landing good kicks, though. Jordan's super relaxed and he's just pressing, pressing gently up. Bit of a low blow. Good sportsmanship. 
Roy is cut. He's cut over the right eyebrow. Jordan finishing very and strong Jordan, in that round. Jordan's fired up. He's ready to fucking. He's ready to go. Is it never since then? He hasn't looked back. No. He's the horse now. Call him the horse. The big horse. <laughs> the big horse. And that's it. Hard he, he work. Was, guys. I would love to have a, I would love to fight the likes of Jordan. He's he's that would be an awesome matchup, hey. See you back in there, Mitch. We gotta get you back in there, mate. Maybe maybe I'll come down your path, do a bit of MMA. We'll see. <laughs> oh, don't do that. Nah, I, I definitely owe Roy one more fight, I reckon. Down the track. Yeah, it's definitely gotta be the dominant um, weight category in Australia. It's just a lot of top boys that these guys can fight. And they're at the top of their stage right now. So a winner of this goes on for the world title. This is, this is a fantastic fight. Like, this is... And whoever does win, it's well deserved oh, as well. Yeah. This is no bullshit title. This is like, these guys deserve a world title shot. Well, it's, this is the, the beauty of WA Muay Thai is guys like this on any given day could challenge for the world title. Uh, styles make fights. On any oh! Nice kick by Jordan. Jordan's pulling ahead at the minute. Jordan's pulling ahead right now. Yeah. Oh, Roy's dangerous. He's got that horse kick. He's doing. He's he's making Roy fight his fight. When he's getting hit, he's not moving. Oh! See. He's not moving. This is, at the minute, this is beautiful work. Look at that, just the evasion Jordan, from Jordan, Jordan is man. Doing, he's on. He's doing, Roy is doing a lot of things right as well. He's, he's landing massive low kicks. He's, he's trying his best to fend off just the one of surging the, pressure of Jordan. One of those fights that you just you don't want to call oh, it too early. Big dunk. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. This is round two, but I, I would give the last two rounds to Jordan the way things are going. Yeah. Have His pressure is, is, is going strong. Oh, he's... And he, he's not backing down. He's in Roy's face. Nice push kick by Jordan. It looks again. Oh, yeah, I will never Roy discredit. I will never discredit Roy Wills, but it almost looks as if Jordan Goffinson is a different weight class. Yeah, he He's looks big. bigger and stronger. Big boy. And that's what's always fascinated me about Roy too. Like I feel like he could fight at a 60 kilo, be a 60 kilo fighter, but he just wipes out people at his weight too. But that's it, Mitch. You need to call out the winner, mate. Do it on the mic. Interesting corner. We all want to see you back. What's that? We all want to see you back. You need to call out the winner after this. Ah. <laughs> Jump in there. We'll see who wins. <laughs> we'll see how good they look. <laughs> Both looking awesome right now. Blair, Blair and Clan not overly vocal in Roy's corner. And Roy, a predominant orthodox fighter, not prepared to change stance too much. I think beautiful checking by. I, I, I think unless Roy can really pressure Jordan into wilting his energy, I think Jordan's gonna gonna, gonna take this. His techniques are looking solid right now. It's he's true. doing a lot of the right things. He's using his height well. He's clinching well. He's definitely getting the points up, that's for sure. Yeah, he's... And that's what I mean, unless Roy can make him wilt, which I don't know if he can. I think, I think Jordan may win this fight. Which is very impressive.
Taking a backward step, just going for him. Nice knee by Roy. Oh, nice kick. Good checking. I don't know about you guys at home, but those, those leg kicks, they, they hurt. They hurt so bad. And both their legs are welted. If you take a close look, both of them oh, are purple elbow. right now. Big right hand. Jordan just happily this, keeping this, him on the ropes. This fight is fantastic. <laughs> like, Absolutely insane. It's such a high level fight. The margin of error is so slim. And you know this fight's going to go again as well. It's just going to be a classic domination fight. Oh, you, you can watch this fight 50 times and see. Oh! Jordan coming out very comfortable now, doing this switch is, kicks. This fight is kicks. off the chain. Oh! oh that look away! Oh! Oh! Oh dear! Jordan with a look away on the head kick, leaned back, just, and just stood there and staunched him. Look how happy the old man is. Bill Seth, got the best team in the house. <laughs> Hey, Stokes. Hey, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Last round. Good kick. Oh! Roy knows he needs a big round. Jordan's... This whole round is going to be insane. Yeah. Punch combo by Jordan, followed by a locking up in the clinch. Roy coming down with some elbows. Sneaky little elbow. I, I think Roy, Roy is nice doing better elbow. there. Roy should have used that time on the ropes trying to elbow. He should have looked for a better position. Oh! Uh, Jordan's doing some very, very smart moves. Awesome He's using range. his length excellently. Yeah. Good check. Look at his range. Look, look at his. Yeah, he's his using range. that length well. Three punches to it. Oh, oh, big I knee. See. It's a massive thing in fighting in the sense of if someone's moving forward at you and throwing shots at you. It's a really big problem. I think Roy needs to. Oh. oh! Roy needs to do that to Jordan. Oh! He's, he's at the point where he's not going to win the fight counter fighting. He needs to attack. No. He needs to go for broke. Jordan, Jordan's doing everything right. Oi. Look at him. Oh! Oi. Look at him. He's, he rises up to the occasion, doesn't he? Like, this reminds him when Jordan fought Appy Set. When he fought Appy Set, he just really rose to the occasion. He didn't stop right he's up to the end. He's, he's doing that exactly well now. He's prepared right now, and he's, he's doing everything right. Very well. He's, he's showing. Again, like I, I don't ever want to discredit Roy. He's he's a fantastic fighter, but he's showing Roy something. Yeah. Then you know Roy's just gonna want to want to fight him again for sure, and he always comes back strong. Roy, he's nasty. He's really showing him something right now. He's showing him another level, I guess. Another youth ability. Preparation. Um, it's hard to quantify what, what Jordan's doing, but he's, he's fighting fantastically. 
Oh, that nice spinning, spinning back elbow. Jack 300, very happy. Congratulations, Jordan. Very well done to Jordan. And I don't know what the hell rankings mean, but... Jordan showing that he's comfortably won. I don't know. I don't know what rankings mean, but he's hey, he's Roy up, coming back. <laughs> Love it. And the respect for both. They're both mates outside the ring as well. This makes it even more crazier. Yeah, the boy. Done it. Well deserved to win the Jordan Goggins.